welcome back to GP, where we're watching more text-to-speech. Today we've got an extra long video. As you know, we continue to do these videos. They've been getting longer and longer. That's what she said? He said? Anyways. We're getting closer and closer to the end of this series, and I don't know... I don't know what I'm gonna do with myself. But do not fret, because today is not the last video. It's just a thought process! It's just a thought process, so everyone get your... Get your noggins working and figuring out what we need to watch next for our Warhammer Wednesdays because text-to-speech has been fucking iconic. What's next? Okay. Oh, shit. What is that noise? Where are we? <gasps> Hi, baby. <laughs> I forgot it was Clown Town! Oh my god, I forgot it was Clown and Cluck! We watched so many shorts in between the last episode and this one that I, I didn't- I fucking- I forgot about the clowns! How could I ever forget about clowns? They're my people! <laughs> Good. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, am I naked, boys? Y'all right there, Miss Man? Uh... I know you Sony terrorists play the part of the stripper girl, but this is ridiculous! Oh my god, he's spanking him! Yeah, slap that ass, bitch! Get him all oiled up and then slap the shit out of him! Whoa! Whoa! Deserves the Nikki shimmy. Okay, Harley Quinn. What you doing, buddy? Oh, oh, oh! We got the giggles again. <laughs> Please never put the meth in method acting. That's coming from someone with an acting degree. Don't do that. No one wants your meth, and no one wants your acting. You're really putting the math in method acting! Oh no. Be quiet. Well, now we'll at least have an easy time spotting the blind solitaires in the library. Woo! It won't be hard. Oh! <laughs> be real with me right now. How many of you still say Bazinga? I do it on occasion, I'm not gonna lie. I'm a slave to that show sometimes. The beginning of it, I was very addicted. I had a shirt that said it. Yep, I said that, uh, I said that on the internet. It's okay, be real with me, it's all right. I won't judge you too much. <laughs> I feel like that's me a lot of the time. I also laugh like that. So much do I laugh like that. So What's the deal with strip club food? This is painful. Oh, it's so painful. I wish somebody would pet my forehead and call me a champ. And little gold sparkle. And everything else I've ever said. I want all those things. I don't have a praise kink. Fine. This is terrifying in a way that I really love. Oh, hi, ma'am! Eldar. Oh? I demand your attention. I am a weapon of shredded destruction. Yeah! I require sustenance befitting of a true warrior of the Emperor. I will give you every form of sustenance you will ever need, ever. My dick, my ass, my tits, food, everything. Whatever you want! I'll give it to you! Your meager Xenos food you presented me with could not sate starvation in a rodent, no less a human at peak performance! Oh my god, she jump scared me! Peak performance! Oh my god! You two clearly okay. tread the paths of the swole, a rare divergence amongst your kind. Where are you hiding the protein? This is Liv. <laughs> this is me after leg day. Where do you hide your protein? Also me, though, I'll be honest. Give me vegetables and protein, dear god. Cease your silence, Xenos. 
I am Ephrael Stern. Your kind wanted me here, and I demand proper nourishment, or I will punch something really hard in the face. Punch me. P punch me really hard in the face, please. Most likely that humongous mind creature. Its face makes me angry. Oh! Are you worshippers of it? You harlequins have poor taste in jokes, directing your faith towards a lanky grot in a bag. Wow! I'm leaving now. I expect okay. food to be ready before my next bit of hunger cramps, or I will start a book burning. This shit really is Liv. She's like, give me what I want or else I'll fucking murder you and your whole family. And then give me a hug now. Okay, bye. And I'm like, whoa. Boner alert. Okay, you all can enter the library now. I have to go plot the demise of the flesh eaters for saying my other other queen's taste of slapstick and solemn jokes. Everybody's a critic. Everybody is a fucking critic. Yeah, YouTube, I'm talking to you. Everybody's a goddamn critic. I see you. Uh, I think. I think it is gone now. Are you sure? I feel dead on the inside. <laughs> Me too. Sega. No. Stop it. No! Might as well go inside, yes. Yes. Let us go. I'm kind of nervous for them. I don't know, man. Oh, we're back. Look at it. <gasps> Do you know how Terra no longer bears any natural water, father? I'm yes, sure I am he well. does? Yeah. That too is funny. Mm -hmm. Why? Because how did that even happen? Um, it boiled away due to nuclear wars and massive overpopulation. Boiling water does not remove it from the planet. It's true. Um, it was stolen by people and brought off the planet. How would one steal one sextillion, two hundred and sixty quintillion liters of water in an <sighs> age of limited space travel and relatively small vessels? Then it was definitely magic to weigh sense. into the warp by those asshole psychers. So most of Terra's natural water now resides in the immaterium. Definitely. Uh huh. That makes it even funnier. Why won't you laugh then? Speaking of water. I need to somehow poorly segue into the fact that <laughs> Brother Ditstitch and the Exceptional Hulk have not fucking returned yet. I yeah. don't see what that has to do with water, father. Damn it, Rogel. You are going to drive me to tears with this new brand of zass blasting you are forcing upon me. Tears are usually made of water, and those custodians tend to collect your tears when you sleep. No way. The Emperor is also collecting e-girl tears? I really need to do that. God fucking damn it. I need to buy some vials. Write that down, write that down! The fuck did you just say? When Gross. a loyal subject of the Imperium dies in combat, uh -huh. their empty eye socket produces a single minuscule tear. I read the subtitles as a single masculine tear. <laughs> oh, take me away. Your empty eye socket produces a single minuscule tear. No, it does not. Yes, it oh. does. No. Yes. No. Yes. Where is he keeping his tear ducts? If he's a skull. I never thought you, my one upright and honest son, uh -huh. would ever pick up the habit of making up the stupidest of fucking lies. It is no lie, father. With the exception of saying sob repeatedly, <gasps> I have not, quote unquote, <laughs> cried for at least 500 years. No. Last time I did <laughs> cause massive floods everywhere. No. Shut the fuck up, I am flashback. No. <gasps> Flashbacking! Hey! A pipe? Oh! <gasps> oh! Not your kneecap! Oh. That's so painful! Oh no! What the fuck? Is that what happened to me? Look at my knee! Look at my kneecap! My kneecap is also fucked up! Am I the emperor? Because I have a fucked up knee? Is it the same knee? I think it might be the same knee. I'm cool. Look at that. Look at my cool fucked up knee. Wow. Who knew? Who the fuck knew? There are the tears. All of the tears. No, you cry all the time. Oh. By my ravishing ribcage, I most certainly do not. This is just most men. I never cry. Cries it like Marley and me or whatever the fuck. I don't know, I've never seen that movie, but I know it's a dog movie and men cry over dogs or some shit. I don't know, men cry over a lot of things, okay? We know, stop pretending, you pussy. I am a skeleton. Skeletons cannot cry, Rogel. That is what makes it funny. Go play with building blocks on a freeway, you insensitive child. Oh my 
god! I did that also kind of one time when I was younger. We won't talk about that. I shall do this. Do not actually do it. Rogel, you fucking idiot. Terrorist freeways could surely be improved. So could my current company. Speaking of, as to complete this dumb segue, I sure wish the Leather Spandex Society would make their homecoming soon. Oh, yep, mm-hmm. Soon as in right the fuck now, you grease goblins. Go, Rogel! Shit. It did T work. Did you expect their timely <laughs> return when you uttered those words? It usually works. People do not appear out of nowhere when you say words, father. Tell that to whoever writes this shit. Bazinga. No! You are writing your speech out upon your text-to-speech device, father. Are you blaming yourself? Da da da! I feel physical fucking pain when you speak, and I barely even have a nervous system. You honey Damn. mustard mustached homunculus. Would you like me to refill your anesthetic tank? Can we just be completely and utterly silent for a few minutes instead? Absolutely, we cannot. Yes, I shall show you how silent and unmoving I've been these past millennia, father. Nobody wants to know what happened when I was asked to be silent and unmoving. It was the fidgetiest experience of my life. I really didn't think I was moving that much. Anytime I think I'm being completely still, my hand's doing this. And I don't notice until after the fact. Like if I'm watching a clip or something, I'm so focused on being stationary everywhere else that I'm like twiddling my fingers all the time, constantly. It's a weird tick. Oh, he's gonna throw it. Yep, there it goes. Uh-oh. 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 We need you now. We lied. Did he just throw liquid nitrogen on the emperor just to bring him back to tears? Is that what I just saw? Fun fact, liquid nitrogen has a boiling point of negative 320 degrees Fahrenheit. It fucking hurts. And now we're in the blue zone. Oh dear. Oh shit. I have probably said this a few hundred times already. Uh huh. Excuse my pendulum complaints. But the web way fucking sucks! It's yeah. like a massive incandescent head space with the heads just made of fairy dust and head Fuck off! I need everyone in the comment section to tell me every last factoid about these little camel bitches. Love them. Obsessed with them. They're adorable. I want 12. It is now your task to teach me about these little camel bitches. Thank you very much. Let's go. Yay! I love him! I think at one point I hated him, and now I sure as fuck don't. I love Kato. He's so good. I was so distracted by the camel bitches that I forgot about Kato Sicarius, and now I want to die. When I say I am frustrated with this goddamn character, I mean I will flip this table over. I'll rip out these headphones and leave. If I have to hear him say his name, 20 million more times, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking lose it, my dude. <laughs> when I, Cassiscarius, find it positively delightful. Uh-oh. Well, there's really no one uh -oh. it. You and the webway share a lot in common, you do. Are you referring to the fact that I, Cassiscarius, provide seemingly endless path to a bright future and remain the last hope for the survival of our species? Definitely. No. I mean that both of you fucking suck. <laughs> <laughs> Eat it, asshole! My glorious chapter master, as the Bathylians clown -ometers are reporting higher levels of honk in this section of the webway. I want a clown -o meter Okay, but like, is a is a clown -o meter like a Geiger counter except for detecting clowniness? Um, like, do you just point it at people and they it makes the like, hurry, hurry, like the the like clown horn noise, but instead of, instead of the like. <laughs> Thing that Geiger counters do, I can't mimic that sound. But like, what if it just like goes a little like, like really, it starts off really gently, right? Um, and like just a little, like a little occasional honk, and then when you point at it or someone real clowny, it's like, you know. Dynamite reports calculate we will arrive in roughly eight point five standard Terran hours. Oh, thank Emperor. This means we're finally making progress. Oh, good. Anyways, punch Hillian in the face for we do not allow him any screen time. Got yes. it? Pardon me, my lord, but what do you mean by do not allow him screen time? 
don't question the things! See, it's a fancy phrase for keeping him veiled, obscured, concealed, shrouded, and absurd, hidden! Force him under a massive blanket or something! I would love to just perpetually live under a massive blanket. The other day, I tried on one of those weird giant hoodies that are blankets that I thought was silly, but my friend had one at her house and I was cold, and I legitimately never want to take it off. I would like to just be a really hot content creator that lives in one of those. Please and thank you. I need to work on the first part a little bit, but we'll get there one day. We will get there. We need to keep him as irrelevant as possible. But, but why? Don't! Ask questions! Oh, Alright! Oh my god! Stop! I can graciously help you to boot to the head as well if you would like! Well, make up scenarios for that! Uh, oh, and my lord, uh -huh. I do not wish to overstep, but I would also like to inform you about the massive ghost titan standing before you. What? A massive ghost titan, you say? Oh my god! Feet people be freaking out right now! Oh! 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 Shit! You human monkai dare tread the paths of the Eldar webway? Foolish primitives! What? We are the lost phantom titan of Morai Oai! We have traversed the labyrinthine roads of the webway for millennia! Okay! I can't tell if this is a real Warhammer thing that I just don't know about, or if this is just another elaborate anime reference. But either way, it's giving Gurren Lagann slash uh, Darling in the Franks, and I'm so there. I'm so there. We have ever yearned for the day when we will slaughter Monkai once again. Our food, our water, our oxygen, our very means of survival have all been the products of our infernal hatred for your kind. Fuck. And now, you come to meet your demise by our hand. Hear me out. Kill him. Captain Sicarius, get rid of him. It's him. Move on with your life. Or, you know, slaughter them all. But as long as you get him... Fabulous. Wonderful. Um, live your best life, please and thank you. Help me get rid of this headache of mine. You come to satiate our incessant hunger for vengeance. Oh, shit! <laughs> wow. Fuck off! Oh. Sparkly pixie machine! Fuck! Ooh. Holy shit, I didn't think it would be that easy. One punch. One fucking punch. One fucking punch. Are you kidding me? All right, let's move on. Excellent showcasing of your prowess, Captain Astor. But if I was you, which I, Cut Sicarius, am not, as I, Cut Sicarius, am the most esteemed Cut Sicarius, I would have personally used the rope to hang My glorious chapter, Master! Jesus Christ! Dare you interrupt the feedback session of I, Cut Sicarius! We have received a secondary mission from Holy Terror, sir! I'm also a Holy Terror. <sighs> right? Oh, we have been sent on the most holy mission, sir! We were yes. told to retrieve and escort the White Scars Primark, Jagatai Khan, out of the webway while we are still here. Hey, that makes sense. Right. We'll go do that first, then. Everyone, prepare your jump packs. We need to be soaring with utmost speed for this mission. I evidently do not require one as I have Terminator armor. That makes positively zero sense, Chapter Master! Shut your face, you shit girl! I do what I want! Yeah, you no, tell him! No, no, no. There he goes. <laughs> Don't say another word. Thank you! <gasps> the rain in Spain falls mainly on the plane. What is this shit? This the is no camel? <gasps> what up, babies? That took way more time than it needed to. Silence, companion! We've not made it this far to be spotted by the children of Vulcan. Can't you just use another worldly magic to turn us invisible or something? I'm with Kitten on this one. The, the being invisible would be much easier, less stress on everybody, uh, them specifically in this situation. Yeah, no, stop that! 
cease your hackneyed propositions, you obstinate poor! I just want to make things easy for a change. No! <laughs> no! I want to make it like a scout and sneak in unseen. I miss being able to do this, going on an adventure, seeing worlds, needing to think tactically. Okay. Ah, uh, it reminds me of the crusade in a way. Oh. You're a ten foot tall wind demon man. <laughs> the only ones who won't see you are people actively choosing not to believe you exist. One hundred percent the people that look at me dressed in cosplay, walking around town going, mm-mm. Not her. Mm -mm. You either have people like staring, taking pictures, excited to see you, or you got the people that are like, I refuse. I want nothing, nothing to do with that. Now you're just being condescending. That's very out of character. And you're being illogical. That's even more out of character. Oh, no, no, no. You're right. Let us make use of a conventional stratagem involving copious amounts of invisibility yeah. with minimal effort on our part. Yes. Just like the Tau would. Fuck sneaking! <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> the order fight! You wanna fight? You wanna fight these fists? Do you wanna fight? What? We'll break into your reliquary, you scowler! What? Gonna take all your artifacts and wear them about! What? We're gonna take your engine thing! What? I'll slap this <laughs> shit, I swear on your mom! My god, angry kitten is next level. Can we have more of that more frequently, please? Thank you. I'll slap this shit, I swear on me, mom. Me, mom, what? What? The tune, the tune, me, mom, what? Fuck, what? more memories. Forget this ever happened, please. And thank you. <laughs> bye, bye, bye. It's really quiet. <laughs> what? what? There it is. The Engine of Woes. Wow! The Engine of Woes. It looks absolutely horrifying. Yeah! The complex machinery that makes up its structure is said to be forged out of Vulcan's very own angst and fury. Damn! He exercised all but his most ingrained hatreds out of his body and into this machine. It is said that sometimes you can even hear the ethereal moans of his despair and anguish echo through it. Are we sure that they're moans of despair and anguish, though? Like, are we sure, sure, sure that it's despair and anguish and not, you know, other things? Is that really true? Hello? Um, hello? I'm trying to express my ethereal moans of despair and anguish, which will echo eternally into the decaying halls of time. Could you please leave? Evidently, yes. <sighs> oh, okay. So... How are we going to get out of here? Well, since you've been insistent in your complaints on taking the easiest routes possible throughout all this, okay, we'll just grab a hold of it and teleport back to the ship. Sound good? But yeah, we'd be teleported right back to Terra, but I guess this is better than sneaking out on the trolley car or whatever you were planning earlier. Oh my god, You kidding. have no sense of adventure. Yeah! Last time you had an adventure, demons happen. <laughs> you've been hanging around father too much. His passive-aggressive attitude is rubbed off on you like your brothers with so much body oil. He's actually been hanging out with you too much. This is the problem. Nevertheless, grab on to me and we'll be out of here. Oi. For a second, a second I thought it was a car. Uh, who's there? With bright green subtitles. Who are you? <gasps> wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Green subtitles? Emperor, I know you're not God. But if this is an orc... I might stop talking quite as much shit about your parenting skills. If you could do anyone a favor for anybody at any point ever in the history of anything ever, make it a favor for me this one time. You know my offer's good. You know I'm good for it. I slap my titties for you every day, Emperor. Thank you for listening. All right, I'm ready to be disappointed. Sorry, please. I'm disappointed. I forgot his subtitles were also green. He's pretty cool, though. But God damn it. Sorry, friends. This here corner of the room is very dark for some reason. I tend to use it for them dramatical entrances in case someone tries to grab me flashy bits. Don't grab the fleshy bits. Are your flashy bits different than your fleshy bits? Which bits are flashy? Does he have his nipples pierced? By the gods. Do you recognize me, brother? Is that the way it is? How long's it been, Magnus? Yeah, no. Since you did that herpy dreadfee. 
Remember that. That was certainly a thing you did, Swart. Why is he speaking like that? Oh, 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 hey there, Vulcan. How's it going? <laughs> How are you even alive? Why am I alive? Why would I want to be dead? Being alive is fun. Sure. All my friends are here. Besides, I tried being dead. Unpleasant it was. Okay, this voice is really making me think that I might get what I want eventually. But I don't think I actually will, but it's got that 2% of promise that I'm looking for that'll make me hold out hope until literally the whole show's over and then I'll die. Almost as unpleasant as the ghost of Ferris Manis. Look at him. Do you see his damn little ghost face? I love it. He is like a skull ghost. No, no. Yes. Yeah. ghost. Uh, a ghost. <laughs> He kind of looked like Nick Cage, just a little bit, and I love it. No, why are you alive in here? You went missing and everyone assumed you died fighting the beast, right? Oh yeah. <laughs> I suppose that means the artifacts actually worked. Huh, fancy that. That makes no sense! Nothing you do makes sense! Stop yelling! Why would that work? That can't be it! That's stupid! <laughs> artifacts are stupid. Yes! yes. I intended their destruction, but a dear friend of old persuaded me otherwise. Oh. So I gave him the responsibility of securing them. I am oh. uncertain what became of them afterwards. Other than that, they disappeared. And yet you are alive! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I like so much how jovial this guy is in the way that he laughs all the time. Just, oh, 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 oh. Me being alive is entirely unrelated to the artifacts, Ray. Really? What? Uh, my intelligence was almost criminally insulted. When you generalize enough at that- War energy! Ah! War energy! The green skin boys are always raving about. You can never be too sure about what will happen. Listen, I knew they were- I was picking up what they were putting down! I could tell! But I wasn't sure! But now wait, is he a mushroom? I have- I- I keep pausing. If I don't- if I just stop pausing the video, I will understand what's happening. Cause they'll tell me, but I'm just, I keep pausing to theorize instead of just watching the fucking clip. What is wrong with me? Shame on you, Nikki. See, I was Fortnite Grind Warbots on Illinois. I was Fortnite. I was Fortnite. Number one victory royal. I was Fortnite Grind Warbots on Illinois. And our random got into a reactor full of sun energy. Then I channelized these savage energies through my mind and body. And Zogan smashed a biscuit with all the more oh, I can okay. muster. And yeah. then everything exploded. I love explosions. And you survived that. <laughs> Absolutely not. My body exploded in a squall of gore. It spread it all across time and space. Good for your body. I wish my body was spread all across time and space. At some point, however, after what felt like an eternity in the blackest of points, uh -huh. I came to once more. Oh. Then I sat down in this here corner. You were just sitting in that corner. For how corner long? For nine God's damned millennia! <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. I love it. <laughs> I think I'm in love with this man. Oh, fuck. Wait, no. I do not recall exactly when my consciousness sprang back into my head. But I did find an old job kept lying about. Decided to go surprise my boys on Prometheus. Oh. Then I discovered I was already on Prometheus. So I jumped down in a drink claw and said hello to everyone. This multiple personality or salamander situation is really... Got me in space. I can't comprehend anything that's occurring right now. Why am I trying to drop shit into orbit only to come back down on a drop pod? That's because the last time I dropped through a planet's atmosphere without a pod, I burned to a grease. Yeah, he exploded. My ability to think thoughts was way far gone after that. Yeah. That day, Pain and I became the best of friends. That is undoubtedly disturbing. Very. Also, why were you in that corner if you just revealed yourself to your entire chapter? Again. Bloody engine, says your glossy kid! Okay, for real, something is wrong with this brain. 100%, yeah. I think a little bit of orc might have seeped into, into you. That sounds really fucking... That's... I don't... My brain can't see past it. I can't... The sentence... I'm so sorry. It's the darkest corner in the system. Eerily similar to the blackest void I enter upon dying the death. 
He feels very homey, so I set up a miniature workshop in it. <laughs> Ever heard of Battle Maze 42 million? Battle Maze 42 million? Only the coolest and most expensive game out there. I play it every Sunday with my friends. Thank you, Games Workstation, for giving me Millennium 42. That is just fucking stupid! <laughs> you are right, friends. Now give me a hug. No, no, keep back. I have no idea why you're so friendly given everything that's happened, but this is obviously a ruse. Also, you don't want to hug Magus. He'd put your eye out. His tits are so sharp. I got nothing but friendliness for you because you are my big, friendly, big brother friend. You yeah. take another step and I'll ensure that you really are dead. You okay, cannot <laughs> make this. I do not mean harm. I but want to give my brother a great big I'm not mad that you ruined everything forever, hug. That yeah. was your god, god damn it! <laughs> Come here, brother. Take hey, another step and I'll give you what- Oh, oh, oh. oh Oh, you blubbering ashen oh, 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 oh. I'm physically ill! I can feel the amount of happiness radiating from the surface thoughts like Dr. Sun on everything! Oh, no way! I've got no million devils to get you! Don't you know? Come here, you get Uh oh! Uh oh! I've been worried about this! <laughs> Hello? Vulcan? I would seriously advise that we stop hugging him. His spine, while incorporeal, still recoils at the touch since it was broken by Lehman Russ. I punched out one of his hearts! Why does nobody remember that? Don't worry, little friend of silver. The hug shall come for you as well. I shall see to that. Please do not do that. I mean it! Don't oh, release me immediately! No. <gasps> <gasps> what is... What in the what? What? He okay, so he's lifting... Oh, he painted the cart. Oh, so what? What? Fuck! Hey, wait, 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 wait. That wasn't meant to happen! You just smashed a Primark with the engine of woe so hard that I'm fairly certain his gene sons felt it. But is that really him? Or is he some kind of crazy orc man that just looks like him now? I have too many questions. What did you expect? Not fucking now! Oh, oh, oh. Hello. Darkness, my old friend. <gasps> no, don't die again. He you just re-killed him. I know. You killed a Primark. Yes, I know. You killed a Primark who was supposed to be dead, but now he's actually dead, I, I guess. I didn't mean to kill him. I just wanted him to go away. Wait, I think there's a what? solution to this. <laughs> Hold on, I just, just need to think for it. Um... Moment. What is happening? What is occurring? <gasps> Fresh air upon my skin is like the flinching daggers of a thousand thousand medial urchins going at a sack of potatoes. All right, cannibal corpse, calm down. <gasps> oh God! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Look what you've done! You've murdered a man and this. Existence is fraught with falls and pointless angst in the midst of this disgusting reality. Nikki? <laughs> the light burns, or I have never been worthy to watch. Welcome to the dark auditorium. My sister has been reading the text in the mirror. I'm sad. Me too. It's too bright. Also, yeah. I want to go back in the park. Yeah, I like to do that too. That's how I feel about my bed every morning I wake up. Wanting to go outside was a terrible idea. The box does not judge. Well, it just hates. Corvus was really Why is Corvus here? What is happening? What is happening? Oh, great. It's Magnus. Saved from my compact, environmentally friendly prison of misery by a traitor. How entirely fitting for mine own failures. No! Memories in the depths of history. Forgotten forevermore. <laughs> forevermore. Get it? The Raven? Still get it? Edgar Allan Poe? Yes. Raven got. Okay. Now I see the Crimson King before me. Wow. Disgustingly alive. So many loyal have fallen. A fitting punishment. <gasps> oh, oh, fuck! You 
murdered Vulcan. Yeah, 100%. He yeah, murdered Vulcan, yeah. Drop site massacre all over again. Oh, wow! Shit. I, I'm so sorry. Now all we require is the flayed, silvered skull of our brother Ferris. Gawking at us, radiating his entirely earned disgust at us both. Great. It shall be a regular family reunion. Awful, awkward, and an atrocity <laughs> upon family values. Oh, God. Thanks, me. You are we, <gasps> Corvus. The little ghost is back. I'm aware, Ferris. God damn it, Ferris. Who are you talking to? A Don't worry brother about it. fallen. One whom you did not even have the gall to come and slay like the rest of your traitor's ilk. Uh, speaking of which, I'm totally gonna kill you once I remember how to use my legs. You know, I say that every day. Where did he go? He's using his wraith slip! Cool! He's making his presence unknown to us. With this ability, he can erase his very perception that he exists from our mind. So you're saying, with this and some other words you're probably gonna say, that he can go invisible. Which is exactly what Kitten suggested not that long ago. And we were told that we were dumb. Yeah, that's right. We, me and Kitten, are one. Okay, Magna. With this ability, he can erase his very perception that he exists from our minds, rendering him as a non-entity! So, going invisible? Yes, pretty much! See, if it would have just done that from See? the beginning, none of this would have happened. We could have just been invisible! <laughs> what did you do to our Primarch? What has oh, done to our precious Lord Lovenhagen? You ruffians! All right, we're out of here! Let's go, 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 go back to the Imperial Palace! Go, 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 go! <laughs> Curses, they disappear! Fuck! What are we going to do, Tushan? Vulcan is dead! Oh god! The answer is forthright, he's down! We must needs give pursuit! Lest the reprobates make their way to their destination unhindered! Oh shit! Obfuscating this goal, however, is the lack of knowledge of their destination! Where does they mean to retreat? They said the Imperial Palace. How forebodingly, excruciatingly, super distressing! How long have I languished within the engine of woes, shoved into here by my beloved, somewhat insane, uh -huh. perpetually happy brother? I'm an emo kid, non-conforming as can be. You'd be non-conforming too if you looked just like me. Oh, get it, Corvus. What have I not been able to gaze upon in the halls of the Imperial Palace that Magnus the Red, nine times damned traitor, could so easily slip inside? Corvus! What the actual fuck? Oh, oh I no! Missed you, friend. Oh look, Vulcan is alive again. Can we also just talk about how the Raven Guard outfits are so fucking cool, especially Corvus's? I don't know if I've actually really seen any art of Corvus until now, other than like tiny in the background, and it is just Chef's fucking kiss, bitch. Vulcan lives. <laughs> Look at that. Ah, ah, Good for that. This day has not gone by that I have not thought of you, my brother. Stop. Oh, your god dead skin smells of ammonia, brother friend. So that's why my nose doesn't work anymore. Uh-oh. Oh, Morgan. Alas, we have travail to inform now about those assholes took over terror or something. Ah! What? Terror? Was that why Silverboy had the distinct shape of a custodian? Can we get off this moon now, please? Need to go to the Imperial Palace, like right now, immediately, very fast. No. Whilst this brightest light and volcanic ash drifts in the air like blackened snowflakes upon wow. the canvas of my albino skin, so wow. Magnus is still on the run. Yes, I wasn't done extrapolating. I need to finalize the hugging of Magnus. I misread that, and I read it as I need to fertilize the hugging of Magnus, and I said, "Excuse me, sir." You need to do what now? I need to finalize the hugging of Magnus. You? Nothing now motivates me more. We need to find him again so this grand event can continue its course. My purpose has been made clear then. I must lash Magnus to super death so no more of this filthy traitor love can be spread. This man keeps slipping into an accent that sounds like Scottish Keanu Reeves. And it's fucking me up inside. Oh, and I'm totally gonna show my poems to dear father's poems. <laughs> They're full of new curse words I came up with. I'm certain dear father, betrayed by nine, will find something I've made be considered worthwhile. <laughs> yes. Good! But the skeletal remains must too be embraced, they do. One bread or bone at a time! But first, I must make a tour of the Imperium of Mark. 
It has been too long since I have gotten a breath of fresh air. We shall see the works we fought for. And after that, we shall see our dead boy. Dead boy! That sounds like the worst idea for a spin-off ever. Now let us all go. Adventure! Haha! Oh, yes. Huzzah! Adventure. Yeah! Yeah! Adventure! Meanwhile... Meanwhile? Meanwhile. Still... Okay. Good. It's a little damp in here. Slightly damp. That was a... Fascinating... Experience. Really, it's no one to get me such a killjoy. Wow. You must feel all fun parts of his brain up with all that tense stuff. Yeah, it's hard. Where did you two extra greasy bacon strips go off to? I love it. Extra greasy bacon strips. I mm -hmm, love, 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 love. A small sliver of your great webway, it would seem, has Ooh. survived Magnus's folly, my lord. Right. I do not really give a shit. It has grown <laughs> connected tissue to a... Massive library is guarded by the largest, most horrifying clown I have ever seen. <laughs> what are these tomes you carry? What are they? Is this the information on the riders of the white scars? <gasps> I must say, who oh. in this galaxy would ever bother recording their events in this meticulous same manner? The white scars are about as exciting as watching Rogel attempt to shift his facial features. How did you even attain these? As we said, Lord, we visited a horrific cloud library by your webway connection. Is there really this much information on them? Is there something wrong, sir? Did we not get sufficient data for you? We can always return to find more. No, please! No use, low with a rubber band, man. I have as much as I need and far Good. more than I want. Did you receive these records from that conical brass to bite a Midas spare call and ex caretaker? Don't say mean things about him. How dare! No, sir. I didn't find him nor that husky tomato magnus anywhere. <laughs> husky tomato, okay. And instead you entered the webway. Your unequivocal idiocy never ceases to amaze. What would you like us to do now, master? You shall share in my cursed cruise for fast knowledge, child. Begging your pardon, sir. Awesome. You have brought me an incredibly ponderous and dull set of records that entirely contradicts the existence of its subject matter, that being doing things very fast. Yet I must learn about this so I know when, how, and where these wife's cars shall serve. But if I am going to suffer through this dissertation of tedium, you are going to join me. Oh, good! May I get a snack? No. no. <laughs> I forgot you were standing there, Rogel. You two shall listen to this gay, mundane exposition. Oh my god. <laughs> you had to, you had to with the Big Bang Theory again? See, I want to be one of these names. Let me be one, please. I've got a great name, Belladina. Tell me that that doesn't sound perfect for any fantasy and or sci-fi and or anything, please. I want to be a voice in stuff like this, so hit me up. If you ever need a voice for any voice sober work, just let me know and I will do it. Whoa, man. <gasps> Holy shit. Every time. Every Time. I'm amazed and scared. I'm always excited for the weird thing jump scare at the end now, but what the fuck was that? That one was a fucking doozy, dude. I went on a mental, emotional, and physical roller coaster ride, and I still don't understand what the fuck was going on with the split personality orc voice. I would like to understand. So I know if I actually owe the Emperor anything or not. I'm living in a very strange gray area and will continue to talk shit about his parenting skills until I receive clarification one way or another. And if I never receive clarification, I'll just keep, keep sinning. 
Thank you guys so much for watching. I am learning. I truly, really am learning so much from each of these episodes. Um, as much as it is fictitious and satirical and obviously not a part of the core lore or canon knowledge, um, a lot of the time my brain retains things a little bit better in a comical sense or things that we've already learned but I'm learning again through text-to-speech. So I really appreciate you guys hanging out and watching with us and also being a part of this journey. I know I've said that many a times, but it's a long journey and it takes some time and I'm really, really glad that I get to do it with you. Do something nice for yourself today and make sure to kiss your own bicep. That's right. You deserve it. Holy cow, holy moly, holy b d b d b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b Easy there. Easy. We're right in a fine line today. It's called TOS. Thank you, games. Um, fuck, hold on. Thank you, games. Um, fuck, what are they called? <laughs> Ew, you ever get just, ugh. I'm so used to wireless headphones at home now that I'm all fucked up trying to deal with cords. Fuck cords. Fuck everything. Why isn't wireless shit better? It's 20 fucking 23. Fuck! It is time to find protein!